On August 31, 1901, Cholgosh traveled to Buffalo, New York, the site of the Pan American Exposition, where President McKinley would be speaking. He rented a room in Nowak's Hotel at 1078 Broadway. On September 6, Cholgosh went to the exposition armed with a concealed .32 caliber Ivor Johnson safety automatic revolver he had purchased four days earlier. He approached McKinley, who had been standing in a receiving line inside the Temple of Music, greeting the public for 10 minutes. At 4.07 p.m., Cholgosh reached the front of the line. While McKinley extended his hand, Cholgosh slapped it aside and shot the president twice in the abdomen at point-blank range. The first bullet ricocheted off a coat button and lodged in McKinley's jacket. The other seriously wounded him in the stomach. McKinley's stomach wound was not lethal, but he died eight days later on September 14, 1901, of an infection that had spread from the wound.